Any word from Pete? Yeah. It kind of. I got a call from Pete's phone. A very nice man. Uh, he's a police officer. He said that the owner of the phone had met with an accident. What kind of accident? What happened? Is he okay? Uh, he went for a run this morning, Marion Canyon. I guess he collapsed and fell off the path, so nobody found him. For... Okay, he didn't leave the country. Didn't run out on his son or on me. He had a he had a heart attack lying in the dirt by himself off the path in Runyon Canyon. Somebody's dog found him. So they asked me to come down to, you know, just to make sure that it was really him and that it wasn't somebody who had stolen his wallet or something. So I went and I looked and I mean, the thing is, it just looked like some guy. It didn't look like Pete. I almost said to the coroner, dude, this is not my husband. It didn't look like anything like him. I mean, Pete's filled with, you know, I mean, even when he's pissing me off, you know, he's, he's, he's warm, you know, I mean, he's, he's in, he's in, he's in motion, he's alive. I mean, that body just so still, so cold, so empty. Violet, are you saying is Pete? Oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh my God. Violet. I know, I know. I have to go home soon, but I just, I can't. If I go home, I have to tell him because, and yeah. How do you tell a three-year-old his father's never coming home?